Mindanao in the southern Philippines is home to some of the most underdeveloped areas in the country. One of them is the village of Semong in the southeastern part. Here, a river that cuts across used to hinder not just people's mobility, but also left residents unable to access proper health care. In one case, it even endangered the life of a doctor on duty in the area. In the early 2000s, Municipal Health Officer Dr. Alfredo La Serona was on a medical mission in Semong. He was on his way to the other side of the village when he almost lost his life because he had to cross through the river. The river current was very strong. We almost drowned. When the river swelled during the rainy season, sick people had to wait for the water to subside before they could cross to the nearest community health center. I know of one case where the expectant mother was bleeding profusely on the other side of the river, but she had to wait for the water to subside before she can cross over. In 2007, the Asian Development Bank funded a bridge that crossed the river, leading to better access for residents. Today, sick people can easily travel to health centers to seek medical care. Dr. Lazarona says malaria cases have also gone down to zero. Health workers can now travel around and visit people living in the village more frequently, while residents can now seek regular checkups from the health center. Sometimes a seemingly small item like a rural bridge can change the lives of people in so many ways. In this village in Mindanao, a bridge has provided the link not just to progress but also to better health. <laughs>